Hello, hello, Souls of Living. My name's Rain, and today we're going to be reacting to The Wanderers, his teaser, and his demo. Uh, they both have officially come out, and I usually wait for them both so we can do a combined video, because otherwise the video would only be like five minutes, and that's no fun. So we're going to be watching the teaser first, and let's just jump into it. I'm excited. Once more, I have lost my heart. Yeah. That scene was so sad. My skin feels like it's on fire. Burning me alive. Turning me to ash. You mean... You wish you had a heart? Hmm. Have you ever heard this story before? There once was a puppet soldier. Whose tin man. greatest wish was to be at the ballerina dog. It was the Tin Man who wanted a heart, right? I haven't watched The Wizard of Oz the in forever. the didn't have a heart. And didn't know where his feelings came from. One day, his owner didn't want him anymore and threw him away into a fire. That's dark. But even in the flames, his eyes never left the ballerina. The next day, the people found a tiny heart in the ashes left by the fire. Probably ashes. So he in the shape did of have heart. a heart. But that's not a real heart. Maybe, but what if hearts can be born from ashes? Yeah, I mean, with how emotional he is, even without the delusion heart or whatever they gave him when he joined the Fatui, um, I honestly think that just because the Gnosis gave him access to his full capabilities or emotional capabilities and stuff, along with like the godlike powers, I don't think he was designed to just be an empty husk i i genuinely think he's had a heart the whole time it's just not been i don't know like in full bloom i guess bad metaphor but whatever let's go <laughs> how dare you die like this oh no and break your promise to me what a joke it's just ashes See, yeah, he, he's genuinely upset. He he does feel things. I feel so bad for him. Only I could have burned to death in that fire too. No. That's so sad. In fact, I wish I'd never been born at all. Ugh. Okay. Um. So him and Nihita are a lot alike. In a way, they were both kind of abandoned by their creators. I know Nihita wasn't really abandoned. Um, but for all she knew, like she didn't have a mentor or anything like that. She woke up without her memories and stuff. Oh no, <laughs> my camera. Um, and Scaramouche, you know, kind of the same. Like He was thrown away by Raiden. And they both kind of spent the 500 years... In, like, a prison, kind of. Well, Skarmouche is more of his own making. Um, all he ever wanted was to have the Gnosis. And, you know, he kept climbing for it, you know. That's the only thing that kept him going. And same kind of with Nahida. She wanted to be a worthy Archon. She wanted to be set free. But whereas Nahida spent that 500 years improving herself, the Wanderer, or Skarmouche back then, he spent that 500 years hating himself. And I, I'm so happy that he's kind of with Nahida now. Because I think of, out of anyone, she could really help him. So I'm excited to see where that goes. So let's let's continue. Oh, it's himself. Never been born at all. Is that really all you wish for? Oh. That was confusing. I'm assuming that's like his current self confronting his past self. Uh, which is kind of cool. Uh, the demo is right there, so let's jump into it. Hoyaverse. Ooh, I like the... Kind of reminds me of, uh, Kazaha's trailer. <sighs> he looks so good. If you guys don't know, I'm pulling for him. I have all the mats to 90 him, day one. So if you guys are still on the fence whether or not to pull for him... Hey, you there! 
Uh, we'll be playtesting some stuff on stream. Gonna need you to show us the way. He's not even gonna. He's not even gonna talk to him. You think they'd recognize him? Like he still is one of the Harbingers, kind of. Too big, strong for Tui. Asking me to be their chaperone. Is this some kind of joke? <laughs> Think you're funny, do you? You'll regret that. <laughs> sure, I will. <laughs> oh! The music. The. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I might have my new main. Just saying. <laughs> Is he gonna do the step on me move? Oh, oh, oh! gonna drop him. He's just gonna drop him. I love him. Oh my god. What a waste of space. Just as useless, alive or dead. You were looking for trouble. No one to blame but yourselves. True. Huh? We're done here. Next time you're looking for directions, I suggest you find your own way. Oh, damn. Oh, that was really good. It was such a weird contrast because, like, in the first trailer, it was like, it was so sad. The teaser was very sad and very, like, really kind of showed, like, how much suffering he's gone through, you know, in his many, many years of life. And that was just, it really just showed that one instance, but the third betrayal or whatever he called it. Um, but the demo, the demo was very upbeat and cool and definitely showed his uh, little bit of a sadistic side, not gonna lie. Uh, anyway, guys, I hope you guys like this reaction, and as always, this has been Rain, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!